started the big drive up north. We're gonna head up to Queensland and get dropped on a tropical island up there. We fished it last year and it was, yeah, it was epic. Organised a boat to drop us out there for six nights. So yeah, I think we're just gonna be fishing two, three times a day and hopefully hook up to some big fish. for about six hours in the middle of nowhere it's about a million degrees Whew. it's gonna be hot up on the island well, I better get back into it too many choices Last minute stop to get a couple of lures. That green guy had a lot of success last time we were up here, so oh yeah. chuck that in the bag. Bit of leader. Yeah. So we just checked the weather forecast. <laughs> Apparently there's a solid heat wave coming. What is it saying? It says, during this week, temperatures are expected to reach up to 38 to 41 degrees each day. Holy shit. Normal daily maximum for this time of year is 29, so these temperatures are 12 degrees above average. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be a hot week. Extreme heat wave. <laughs> <laughs> a good time to go up. Right. Final stop on the mission. Let's do a chop. Pretty healthy so far. Got a lot of fresh stuff. Out. A lot of fresh stuff. A lot of food. <laughs> Huge shop. I think it's a double trolley. Eh? Stocked and ready to go. Solid drive. It was like 14 hours or something. No AC, 35 degree heat. Not a very good combo. But we're here now. Just pack up here camp for the night and then in the morning get the boat over to the island. Yeah, pretty keen. Dropped to the island. Pretty much just got enough stuff for the six days. Water, food, everything we need. Yeah, I got some good fishing ahead. Chilling. Ew. Yes. Oh. 
Oi, hey, Ross. I got a, I got a hook in my thumb, eh? Can you get the pliers? Really psycho. I mean, you're gonna get that fish off, but it's like a proper hook through my thumb. Uh, that is. Woo! Is that bothered for me? Just get him in. Did water release him? Oh, maybe just chuck him back. First fish. Hook through the thumb. <laughs> Holy shit. You got us? Skit! Oh, <laughs> I'm shaking, eh? Oh, fuck. Oh, man, that was so, so gnarly. <laughs> that is in blood. Fuck. fuck, dude, that's solid. That was pretty good, but I don't yeah. know what you'd do if you didn't have pliers. Oh, yeah, It'd be yeah. skit. Um, finished learning the first fish of the trip, but... I was trying to take the hook out, flapped and um, the hook went straight through my thumb. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, no, I won't see it like rough. rough Ooh, bro. that was scary. Luckily we could chop the barb and get it out pretty easily, but... Another cod. Prince over this side, hey. Wow, that looks amazing. Good choice. Yeah, I definitely reckon walk down to the left, hey. Land of the oyster. Oh, yep, GT, GT, no, 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 Spanish. Oh, big, big. Right past the ledge, just then chasing bait. Wow. They went this way. Fuck, that was massive, eh? They were like, tanks. First day of fishing. Pretty much done. Gave it a good go, but didn't really get too much action. But pretty nice sunset to wrap up the day. And conditions are looking minty. It's day two. Wind was supposed to be pretty north this morning, but luckily conditions are in our favor. First time fishing the main ledge, so pretty psyched. Didn't have too much luck yesterday, just a couple of cod and a uh, hook through the thumb. Hopefully we can do a bit better today. Yeah, buddy, you got a good spot there. Just hang with him. Damn! You got snipped, eh? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> no! That looked good. That looked big, eh? Yeah, I couldn't get any hurt on him, eh? No. I swear you almost just can't even when it's like that, eh? No. You just gotta lock in and just, just gotta, yeah. ride that. That's fast on the coast. Really? Yeah. They're out there. Oh, it's pretty nice zone just here, hey. You can just see that drop off into like the deep water. Yup, yup, yup. Yeah, 
boy. Fuck, he's going down. Holy shit. Come on. Fuck in for a good fight. Nice. Yeah. You got time. Looks pretty heavy. Yeah. Oh yeah! Woo. <laughs> yeah! No! Brutal! What happened? Hey, Ledger. I think so. I just got snapped. Wow. Or it, or it just me. Wow. Holy shit. That was a nice fish as well. Woo. Just hooked onto a pretty solid fish, got about a minute of the fight and then got snapped off or reefed or something. Chucking on another little ghost. The old trusty ghost from Bill Trick. Get back out there. Our first morning down the main ledge was pretty mental. We first got down there, the tide was coming in pretty heavily, so there was lots of current around. There was bait everywhere. The island just felt really alive. There was um, tuna busting up, we've seen some mackerel swimming past. It seemed like the first half an hour, 45 minutes, most casts would um, hook on all fish. Yeah, dude. Unfortunately, we either get snipped, ledged, or pull the hooks or something happened, and we couldn't seem to land anything. Oh, Starting no. to get a bit frustrating. That lure, that queen fish. Woo! Oh, that was a good queenie as well. Yeah. I felt pretty decent. It's probably like best session I've had, I reckon. So much action, just need to land one now. Because you put so much effort into hooking up to one of these fish, if something goes wrong and it's your fault and not you're tired or the way you fought the fish, that moment keeps replaying in your head, what did I do wrong and how can I avoid that situation again? So it's quite a steep learning curve. Felt like our gear was a little bit outdated but soon enough our luck started to change. I go with that footage BA, just a big like GT there. Bring him in here a bit closer. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we got him. Yes. We got him. Oh. Woo.
super stoked. After seeing the potential of this ledge and realising this was only the first morning of our trip, we couldn't wait to get back down there. <laughs> 